My name is Dr Karen Brown and I'm coordinator of the EULAC Museums project. EULAC Museums is an international research project funded by Horizon 2020, the biggest European Union research and innovation programme ever. Our research falls under the category of Europe as a Global Actor INT12, the cultural, scientific and social dimension of EULAC relations. Our aim is to build close relations between Europe, Latin America and the Caribbean in the field of community museology. Our international consortium consists of eight partners working in academia, the museum world and policy in Scotland, Portugal, Spain, France, Costa Rica, Peru, Chile and the Anglophone Caribbean. The project is coordinated by the Museums, Galleries and Collections Institute located in the School of Art History at the University of St Andrews in Scotland and was conceived and continues to be supported by the regional alliances of the International Council of Museums, ICOM Europe and ICOM LAC, whose presidents serve on our steering committee. So what is our research about? Museums hold an unequalled responsibility to communicate the shared history and cultural, political and economic ties between Europe Latin America and the Caribbean. Museums have enormous capacity to reach all levels of community, from towns to remote villages, and can be neutral spaces for building social cohesion and reconciliation in a variety of contexts. Together, our research teams will determine commonalities and share best practice across regions. By focusing on the themes of museums, community and sustainability, the EULAC Museums project will create a common vision for sustainable, small to medium sized local and regional museums and their communities and reinforce mutual understanding and cooperation between our regions. The project is structured around thematic work packages dealing with the cross-cutting societal challenges of a technology and innovation for bi-regional integration b museum education for social inclusion and cohesion c investment and entrepreneurship for sustainable museums, and D, exhibiting migration and gender. In so doing, we are pushing forward the agenda of the EU CLAC Action Plan in Museum Practice and Theory. One of the most exciting activities of the theme of Museums Education for Social Inclusion and Cohesion is a collaboration between the University of St Andrews, the National Museum of Costa Rica, and the National Museum of Archaeology in Portugal, where 12 young people from Europe and 12 from Latin America have engaged in a bi-regional youth exchange, working with local community and eco-museums. This initiative has been designed and led by our project youth project worker, Jamie Brown. To promote the Horizon 2020 goal of fostering inclusive, innovative and reflective societies, the EULAC Museums project has sought to research state-of-the-art initiatives in both museums and community empowerment. Then, moving beyond these initiatives to implement and evaluate our own bi-regional youth exchange between Europe and Latin America. Aiming to both transform individual lives within the museum communities and to create a method of implementation and evaluation that will be applicable to wider regions. The exciting and empowering bi-regional youth exchange was between the indigenous communities of Costa Rica the rural communities of Northern Portugal and the island community of the Isle of Skye in Scotland. It was coordinated with full community participation and consultation. Over the two year period, young people in their own communities engaged in workshops discussing their identity, heritage and community memories, whilst building their self-confidence through tailored activities. In between workshops, each young person was encouraged to visit their local community museum, map their community and interview community elders learning about the past. Each young person was encouraged to document their journey through an online blog. The young people were empowered to develop their own code of conduct and rules whilst being a part of this experience. In the first year, the Europeans travelled to Costa Rica to experience the indigenous communities of Baroca, Recure and San Vicente. In the second year, the Latin Americans travelled to Europe 
to experience the rural communities of northern Portugal and then onwards to the rural island community of the Isle of Skye in Scotland. Visiting each other's region and community were a key factor in this programme to learn, share and understand the way of life in each place. Each community opened their doors and truly embraced one another to their respective way of life, leaving the young people more confident, empowered citizens of the world and a lasting legacy and partnership between the communities involved. To conclude, while we've highlighted one aspect of the project in the Bioregional Youth Exchange, there are many more exciting outcomes from project themes, including a new database of community museums, 3D scans of community icons from each country, bioregional research into water heritage, intangible cultural heritage and sustainability, and new knowledge about the interconnection between gender and migration for understanding Caribbean societal challenges and diaspora. Through research, practical and policy outcomes, the EU LAC Museums project therefore seeks to share concepts, experiences and sustainability of eco and community museums in both regions and to celebrate our findings and collaborative outcomes with the international museum community. One of the key ways we are achieving this goal is through our project partner ICOM and in working collectively towards an exciting new roundtable discussion being held in Brussels in April 2019. Thank you for listening.